Hi everybody, this is Ty Williams, and yes, this is a wrestling video because I got so many wrestling fans in my channel, and I'm a psychic um, predictor, so it just it just mind boggling. But anyway, um, people was telling me what do I think about Nada Rose becoming AEW's woman champion. And this is what I think about it. To be honest with you, she should have been the first AEW's woman champion because she represents diversity. She represents what AEW is all about. Like diversity in professional wrestling. Like everyone is welcome. Young and old, straight and gay, black and white, everybody is welcome. And I feel like the problem with people who are against the idea of Nala Rose becoming a woman champion because they got used to the old idea what wrestling is supposed to be. And like I said, um, I don't have no problems of Nala Rose becoming AEW's Women Champion. And I watch AEW wrestling because of her. Because I feel like she could bring lots of fresh ideas, originality. She's a big nerd, a big geek. She gets what all of us as people is like everyone is different everyone is unique everyone is extraordinary you know and i feel like her becoming aw's woman champion it give a bigger light of there are people who are different there are people who represent each culture, each thing. They don't have to be the stereotype what the WWE is doing. And I feel like people who say transphobic comments are Jim Cornette fans and WWE fans. I'm going to keep it real. I'm going to be honest with you. And I'm going to psych it. Jim Cornette fans and WWE fans who are WWE marks be saying these racial and bigotry and transphobic comments towards Nala Rose and also to Rio too. And I understand why Rio um, lose the AEW Women's Champion against Nala Rose is because of the racism that she deal with. And it's sad. And I also, I believe that people are being very mean spirit in Twitter and sending hate comments and hate letters towards fans and um, towards AEW fans and AEW wrestlers. And I feel very opposed and sad and also I feel that is why I'm done with professional wrestling because so much toxicity is so much negativity and like if I feel you are a negative person you are out of my life you are gone that's how I that's how I deal with life but back to Nala Rose I feel like she will make AEW Women Division interesting and um, remarkable because I feel like she is the glue and the hope what modern day wrestling should be. You know, and modern day wrestling, there are lots of like gay people who is like bisexual, pansexual, um, gay, lesbian, um, did I say bisexual? Um, straight. It's like 
like the modern age nowadays in professional wrestling, everyone is different. You know, everyone got their different flaws, their different appeal, their different everything. And for her to be a woman wrestler and a champion, that will give AEW more light of who they are as a company. And I feel like they did a right thing of of her to become champion. And that is what I see. And I feel like people not giving her a chance yet. But trust me, she gonna have she gonna have a very interesting year in AEW, trust me. And I could see her feeling with Kenny Omega. And trust me, she's going to have a few with Kenny Omega. And I could see it coming. I could see it coming. I could feel it coming. I could see it mile away. Like, she's going to bring something interesting in AEW. Just watch and see. So, anyway, this is Ty Williams. Good day and goodbye.